Thanks, Chairman. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, thanks for coming to our session. And uh, uh, congratulations the 10th anniversary of Kubernetes. Um, my name is Naoki Oguchi. Uh, I'm with Ephesus Technologies, a group company of Fujitsu. And uh, I'm responsible for developing uh, infrastructure software. Uh, today, I'd like to talk about uh, how Kubernetes and uh, a composable disaggregated infrastructure uh, can uh, realize a sustainable world. Uh, recently, a generative AI opened the age of AI, and as a result, enormous computational resource, resources are required. Uh, this uh, this needs lots of power to operate. On the other hand, realizing sustainable, sustainable world is an uh, urgent issue for us. We are always expected to reduce power consumption. Uh, that means we need to satisfy uh, 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 higher performance and uh, power saving simultaneously to cope with these uh, conflicting requirements, uh, composable disaggregated infrastructure, CDI, is expected to, to be a solution. CDI is uh, an emerging new server architecture. It disaggregated servers existing servers into separate components. Each component is connected to PCIe or CXL switch, and uh, they work as a resource pool. By config configuring the switch, a uh, user can create custom-made server on demand by software definition. Uh, to provide higher performance and power saving, uh, we combined Kubernetes with CDI. When there is a uh, heavy workload, Kubernetes can request CDI to attach GPUs to worker node and provide higher performance. And when there is a lighter workload, Kubernetes can request CDI to detach GPUs and uh, power off to, to save power consumption. We call this mechanism dynamic device scaling, and uh, we believe this is a key technology uh, to, to realize sustainable world. Let's introduce use case of CDI. In ION Remote Real-Time AI Analysis Park, uh, video streams from security cameras are aggregated and uh, uh, AI inferences are executed at uh, regional edge cloud. In this park, CDI is expected to dynamically attach and detach GPUs depending on the number of video streams uh, at daytime and nighttime, and to balance high performance and power saving. Uh, to widely spread the CDI architecture, we believe open develop development is essential. So right now, we are developing these functions with OSS communities. For example, we are developing uh, CDI operators and DRA extensions with Kubernetes communities. And we also developing CXL functions with the Linux kernel community. Moreover, we are going to be a member of Cloud Native Computing Japan and promote CDI special interested group. Uh, as mentioned here, uh, we want to realize a sustainable world with OSS communities. Finally, uh, we are showing our first CDI server and demonstrating dynamic device scaling. 
at the booth D3. Um, also, ION Global Forum is showing uh, uh, introduced park at the booth next to us. So please come and see us. Thank you very much. <laughs>